Do you think your dichotomy carries through this whole uh, set of testimonies that we've heard? I, I think not. Ab I, okay, absolutely. Because it's a simple fix. It's called soundproofing. And it can be done. I run a studio. I have it. NPR has it. It does work. We need to implement it. Instead of criminalizing the people who are the least of us, who are the most disadvantaged in the city, which you clearly don't have any concern about because you have the speed of this legislation, but you have nothing to do for a retention plan for long-time residents and small businesses who are also suffering and being pushed out of the city. There was no speed in that, and I have yet to even hear an answer from anyone in this council to address that issue. But for the comfort and the minimities of the new residents, you're building over backwards for them. So I think you're, I think you're right. The dichotomy is there because the disparities in the city is very real. We need to have soundproof in this built in this, this city if we want to continue to increase the density of the city. I think you'll say y'all trying to get up to a million residents. This problem's not going away, and you're not going to do it by locking people up. Nobody's talking about locking people up. That's what up. this bill calls for. Ten days in jail. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Councilmember Vaughn. Thank you, Chairman.